NFL. I'm here at Whole Foods to share a delicious goat cheese toast appetizer. This is a no fuss appetizer and it's actually good straight out of the oven hot or room temperature. So you can transport these if necessary. So let's go ahead and go through the ingredients. We have sourdough baguettes already sliced, drizzled with a little grapeseed oil, pepper, freshly cracked pepper, a little sea salt, softened chevre goat cheese, grated pecorino romano, some chopped parsley and rosemary, a little heavy cream, roasted garlic, shallots, and kalamata olives. So let's go ahead and get started. Today we're going to ditch the hand mixer and actually literally use our hands to mix this. So we're adding the softened goat cheese, a little of the heavy cream, the pecorino romano, and just stir it until it's a smooth consistency. And we didn't, I didn't add all the heavy cream at once because I want to make sure that we can get it all worked in really well. Add just a little bit more of the heavy cream. Then we can go ahead and add our herbs to it also. We'll spread this on our toast and put it in a, a preheated oven about 375 degrees for 15 minutes. And that'll give you enough time to spruce yourself up, get your olive compound ready. This is it. So we'll take our toast and give it a nice, about a tablespoon. Don't be skimpy. It's nothing that you have to go out and buy a lot of special ingredients for. And we tried this with sourdough baguette, the regular French baguette, and also the whole wheat baguette. This appetizer is great because it will please everybody, including the vegetarian. Place these in a preheated 375 degrees oven for about 15 minutes or until your nose tells you that they are ready and they will actually have a little caramelization on top and after they come out of the oven that would be the perfect time for you to whip up the olive tapenade two minutes no problem this is just a toss out there's no particular order in how the ingredients should go in and remember this is just roasted olives kalamata olives roasted garlic and roasted shallots just mix it until everything is well combined and that looks just about right, that's perfect. I think our toasts are ready. Let's take them out of the oven, top it with our a la tapenade. So we've just taken these out of the oven and now we will place our olive tapenade on top. Told you, 20 minutes and you've got a hit appetizer that will please any finicky guest that you may have. Another tip with this olive tapenade that I like is cooking some pasta and tossing this in pasta or serving it as an accompaniment to grilled fish or even chicken. So it has multi uses or you can just eat it like it is actually. That's how I like to do it. There you are. Cheese toast is delicious and simple in less than 20 minutes.